Hey everyone, welcome back to Resident Evil Zero. When we left off, we finished mm, the first boss and also the red doors. We got everything from the red doors, which was the iron needle and I forgot, and the lighter field fluid. So, now in order to continue, we're gonna go into the iron needle puzzle, which is really not that difficult. It's also not that big of a deal, really. And. I believe we might even be able to do the statue puzzle if everything goes right. So first of I'll first off, I'm gonna there. leave Billy yeah. here. There's really no need for him to follow me. Because we're gonna be doing the iron needle puzzle. And that requires us to go all the way back to the to that first room where we got lifted up by Billy using the crank handle. And that's gonna take a few <laughs> some time because Getting there is, well, it's an issue. There are some eagles out here, and I don't know if they're actually gonna combo them to death. <laughs> Hello? Yes, they are. Oh god, no. Please don't. Thanks. Okay. Now, this area is really easy to clear. <laughs> Just by exploiting the AI. So basically, this area, this area above these stairs, is in a completely different realm of existence. You can't shoot anything from here, they cannot ac attack you from down there, they cannot go up these stairs. It's just a completely separate dimension on all of it, on, on its own. So all you gotta do is go down here, shoot, and when they get near, just get up. And just by hearing, you can tell when they are gone. When they are gone, go down, shoot again, one, two, until they get... Until you can see them on your screen, then head up here. Make sure to keep track of, on your, of your bullets. Exactly, because of that. If you reload in front of them, you're gonna have... You're gonna have fun times. Okay, now we head up here. And even if they do manage to hit you, I mean, if you see on your screen that they are totally touching you, if you are already under stairs, you are completely safe. <laughs> Abusing the AI is always fun. There's one, and I wasn't on the stairs, goddammit. Is that a danger? Yeah, it's a danger. That's why I brought this with me. Which Billy had, but I just gave it to me before. Before the recording starts, so. Oh boy, he didn't leave. Come on. Don't make me look bad. Okay, I'm not bad, I swear. It's not like I already recorded this three times. Go on, leave. There you go. Okay. So if you remember from the last episode, I... If I remember correctly from last episode, uh, we read a note that said that the code was quarter past eight. So pretty much that's all we have to do with this. So we just move that to, to 15 minutes. That's 15 minutes. And now the hour hand. And we need to go to 8 hours, so that's 11, 9, sorry, 10, 9, and 8. We're gonna click OK. And that's gonna open the, f the door to the back end of the first floor and the door in the second floor. And the... come on. Okay. And now we need to get back over there get the microfilm A which I just left dropping the ground and the microfilm B which is in one of the doors that got unlocked and do the microfilm puzzle so we can actually do the the uh, conference room puzzle come on camera angles please fix camera angles I, I I mean what time is it right now I need to keep time with this crap okay 10 13 right now Eight fifteen, like the code. Oh, no, no, nah, not really. So now we need to get back, back down there, and I hope we can do the, the angel wings thing. I'm gonna need my camera for that because I, my memory freaking sucks. Mm, Follow me. Come on. Yeah. Oh god, no. I'll go. You stay there. Okay. Actually, you go. 
So first, you gotta check the one in the second floor. That's the one that has a microfilm V, I think. And also a poem that... I mean, I can read, but it's not really that useful. A verse of poetry. The moon bows to the earth, the earth swirls loyalty to the sun, and the great law of the sun governs all things. This itself is the keystone, the pointer to glory, all our hands cannot open the door to heaven. It really doesn't seem to rhyme to me, but okay. Hey, come on. No? No, not that. Yeah, there you go. Okay, it's a B. Now, how the hell do I get out of here? That thing. That way. Good job. Please let me... Yes. Okay. That zombie usually gets me. Especially that one. And it's really annoying when it does. Actually, don't know why I sent Billy. Because Rebecca's gonna be the one doing the the puzzle. Okay, that's what I'm gonna do. You are gonna have the shotgun. And I... I'm gonna have the microfilms. This way! Okay. I need to have you behind. Sorry, not behind. Uh, follow me. But, okay, what's using inventory space? Why do I have this gun? <laughs> oh god, I didn't want to have that gun. That completely ruins everything. You. You take care of this. Why the hell do I have this gun? Okay, now. The difficult part. Just grab the goddamn thing. There. Is that ink? Yeah, it's ink. God damn it. No, not ink. We don't need ink right now. Just... That's the grenade launcher. No. <laughs> Is that it? Oh, thanks. You stay here. No, you yeah. stay here. Should I take the? Sh no, I'm not taking the shotgun. Huh. Okay. I just took Rebecca because down here there are two herbs that I can just mix in the go, and. Hmm. I, need, I really need to start counting how much bullets it takes to kill a zombie just to know if something is worth or not because on the back end there's there are some bullets but I'm not sure if killing those two zombies to get those bullets will be worth I mean even if I get one bullet out of it I mean I let's say that I waste 14 and I get those 15 that's completely worth <laughs> it's one extra bullet and that can save my life so even that would be worth but I'm not entirely sure if this time was worth it or not. Okay, we are fully loaded. So, this thing appears. Ignore him. It's the third time I already record this. <laughs> I already learned that fighting those things is not particularly easy. That's like doing things the hard way. The unnecessary way. <laughs> God, with like the amount of bullets that I had, I couldn't kill him. With all the bullets I had, I could not kill one. And there's two of them, so yeah. Now we just need to use that. Insert, because we're missing another one, which is the microfilm A. Um, what else? There's something written on the top of the picture of the seats. Yeah, that's pretty much in numerical order or whatever. So we get the MO disc. And what they say, microfilm image, the resulting image of the overlaying of the microfilm A and B. Numbers appear on the seats of the conference room. So basically it goes from 0 to 9 and from A to F. And that's going to be useful for the conference room puzzle. Shoot. I... No. No, fuck that. We're, we're not getting those bullets. If I feel that we're going to need, need them, I might go back up the camera, but I really don't think we're going to need those 15 bullets, so... They're way too hard to get. Another guy comes here, ignore him. No point on dealing with him. And with the time I escape from here, I think I have an opportunity to go back with him still doing that animation. Come on! Come over okay. here. Also, give me my shotgun back. Yes, I do have space for that. Give me my shotgun back. I want my shotgun. Hmm. So now we're heading to the conference room to complete that puzzle. What time is it? It was 10 13 of you. 10 18. Okay, that's 5 minutes. 5, five good minutes. 
You stay here. Stay there. Okay. And just insert the ammo. The nope, not that one. Don't use that one. Not yet. Reading system complete. Uh, access complete. Release system activated. Please insert code zero A. Okay. So zero A. This is zero. So we just st step here. And now this is one, two, three, four, f four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, A. Okay. So it's this one. There we go. Head to Rebecca first. That's zero. A. And that should release the doors with the with uh, the swords. Yeah. This is pretty much the only one that's gonna be useful right now. That's the one from the very end of this area, and that's the one from another semi puzzle. But we're really not gonna be using. Let's regroup. Okay. Anything other than this one in this episode, at least, and in later episodes, actually. Yeah. So, oh god, no, I didn't want to go there. Not yet. There's still some. Oh, whatever. I'll just head out. Yeah, I didn't want to go there. I wanted to go to the other door, but... I got caught up in me talking to actually pay attention to where I was going. <laughs> oh, good. So... There shouldn't be any zombies here because we killed the ones... The last, one to sp the last ones to spawn here. I believe it was the last ones, at least. And now, if you read this this thing, it says the old man is holding a candle in his hand. This this light will guide you to a greater truth. And guess what? We have a lighter. Here's a candle. There's a locked door. Pretty self-explanatory. Pretty, pretty self-explanatory puzzle. So you just light the candle. The door is going to unlock. Billy, you're gonna wait here because I'm gonna waste shotgun I'll go alone. Here. Okay. There's two guys in here that, I mean, are easily avoidable. I have previously avoided them, but frankly, we have the bullets. We might as well just kill them. So, let's, hello, and he's still alive for death, one, two, and now we change to handgun because I'm not wasting more bullets and more uh, shotgun bullets. One, two, three. And here's something that we're gonna need later on. Some more grenades for the grenade launcher. And I believe we, we get more later on, but I'm not entirely sure where. Oh. Anyways, we need Billy for this. Get up. Come on. There you go. Because he's he's strong and he can move this shelf. So go on, Billy. Just move him with your might. And we're gonna get the Book of Good here. Okay, we cannot examine it from here. I just was. I was thinking you could. I thought you could. So you just gotta examine this. Open the book. And you're gonna get the wings for the angel. But we're still missing the wings of the... Of the devil, of the devil statue. We're eventually gonna get them later in this episode, so we just grab those. Come on, Roger. come over here and head head out. Get in, get out. The CCSZ. Hmm. I'm trying to think. What else are we missing? I don't think we're missing much, actually. Not this way, it's that way. I mean, besides those 15 bullets that I left behind, what else are we... Are the... What else are we missing? Or we might be missing? Let's much. split up. Roger. Now change to Rebecca. I have enough bullets to kill these two guys, because... No way to go around them. This game is just silly, so... <laughs> They're gonna eat up a lot of bullets, and I'm actually gonna count them. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I thought 
Dark Hero sound. Uh, not that way, what? Okay, thank you. Death. Why? Come on! God. The thing that I hate is also why killing while killing these things I have to be quiet because I'm too concentrated and I didn't even count the bullets. But I got hit twice. <laughs> it's okay. We're still okay in healing items. I mean we have Oh my god. Stop. Let's go! Yeah. So this puzzle is is uh, interesting in the fact that if you move a grunk piece you get poisoned and you don't want to get poisoned. No, 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 no. That's not something you want to do. I'm gonna grab the ink ribbon. How many of these are there? We're in danger already. We have one, so it's okay have one ink ribbon, we're also gonna get some ammo from here and here's the place uh, no 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 don't push that you fucking moron okay I'm gonna take a picture of that one it changes depending on your game it's not always the same just so you know uh, so I'm gonna take it's always necessary for you to look at this it changes each time I'm gonna take a picture of that one because I suck at remembering so just gonna take a, a quick picture of that and I'm gonna check it so just gonna go to gallery over here okay I already have a I'll go okay a picture of it so so what do we need to change okay the king No, oh, oh my god. Fucking hate this. Okay. <sighs> really? Okay. So I need to get him all the way back here. Then all the way to the left. Sorry, to the right. And then all the way up. And that should be it. So... There you go. I'm gonna check the time again. Might as well just have my phone. 10.26. That's 30 goddamn minutes. So, go on, Billy. You can grab that. I believe in you. That's the Book of Evil. And that's the final piece to our... There. Wait, there's something more. What? Oh! Yeah, this is a long text, so feel free to pause it at any time. Yeah, that was a long ass text. But okay, with the Book of Evil, we do exactly the same thing we did with the Book of Good. So we just examine it, turn it around, open it, and we're gonna get the missing wing. And there's also something else we can get from this room that we're gonna need later on. If this is this laboratory, I really don't remember if this is the laboratory. What the hell is this? It has to be the laboratory. I'm just gonna check real fast. If it's the laboratory, let's regroup. Roger. I'm just gonna leave it alone, really. Because, yeah, I'm gonna leave it alone. 
but I'm curious because that shape looks weird. <laughs> this has to be the laboratory, right? Oh god, I don't remember. Yeah, this is laboratory. Okay. Sorry, the clinic, not laboratory. It's it's more like a clinic, like uh, mm, a hospital room. Oh god, I don't know the exact word. Oh boy. Okay, but that's not interesting right now. In fact, we're not gonna be using that until later. But I do want to get something from there before we advance any further into the game. So. But uh, I guess I'll do that in the next video, because right now we're almost at, what, 15 minutes? 15 something? That's, yeah, around 17 minutes right now. So we're nearing the, we're nearing the end of this. So now, for those of you who didn't get got the chance to read this, which I know some of you didn't, it's, it says, Oh god, you can't actually... Okay. It basically says that when the balance of of good and evil are... Where good and evil are balanced... Uh, okay. God damn it. <laughs> we might be able to read it after this, though. Okay. What does it say? There. There's something written on the base. When the good and evil are brought into balance, a new path will be opened before you. That, that's it. <laughs> so now both statues wait the same, so we just gotta place them. And now we're missing the statue of good, and that's gonna open a new path for us to explore upon. Yep, there you go. This is poison area, my favorite area. Actually, it's not that bad of an area. I rarely get hit there. It's enemies are easy to bait. They have a really low health pool. We're gonna be needing this thing though, because no, not the hook shot, not yet at least. That's an ink ribbon. Oh my god! <laughs> the issue is that there's so much. Crap over here. Okay, let's try approaching it from a different angle. Is that it? <laughs> Whatever, I'll just pick it up <laughs> off camp. For now, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. And leaving constructive criticism, constructive criticism in the comments is always appreciated. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next time. See ya.